What is up guys, Next in Crafting here, bringing you an updated video for the OpenGL error on Minecraft. This is basically the same thing as last time, except I'm removing the disable visual th themes thing, because that didn't work for a lot of people. So what you're going to want to do to fix that is start, go into control panel, click in your display settings, click change display settings, advanced settings, you click over to the troubleshoot tab and then you would click change settings go to the tab all the way at the end and lower your hardware acceleration to the third tick for some reason it doesn't let a lot of people do this though some people it does some people it doesn't just depends on your video card but another solution if that doesn't work is go to the manufacturer's website for whatever video card you use. Mine's an AMD, so I uh, go in here, just Google AMD, and you click on their website, and then you click on the support and drivers, and then you click here, put in all your settings, desktop graphics. Mine's a Radon, Radon, I think it's the X-Series. Not really sure about that. But yeah, you just put yours in there, search for it, download it, whatever it comes up with. Should show you the latest updated one and then you just download that and install it and that should also fix it but if that doesn't fix it then your computer is probably a piece of crap because when I got that error before I was doing it on my laptop and that thing is a piece of crap it could barely handle Minecraft but with my new desktop it can handle it just fine along with a lot of other games um, I got an AMD Radon HD 6450 in there. It's not the best graphics card, but it's not a cheap low-end one either. Gets the job done. One reason that you might get the OpenGL error is because you have a crap video card. And usually the crap ones are the ones that come in Dell computers all the standard ones with Dell computers, no name brands you can A update your computer or B update your video card only now if you're just gonna update your video card I recommend NVIDIA or AMD those are the two top of the line ones in my opinion so if you're gonna do that then you should get one of those if not then if you're deciding to get a new computer check out my how to become popular on YouTube video there's a link in the description to the computer that I'm using right now it's only 500 bucks I believe on walmart.com really good price for the computer and it's a really good computer the only problem that I've had with it was about six months after I got it the fuse in the power power unit went out and I was just going to replace the fuse, but I decided to get a whole new power unit altogether. And one thing I read about the power unit is it's not a 500 watt like they say. It's only about a 200 watt. Because there's this company that did the review for it. They took the entire thing apart, looked at all the parts and everything. These guys are experts too, and they determined that it's only a 250 watt, which can't handle a lot of the devices in there. I upgraded to a 400 watt because it was a really cheap price and it was on sale. But eventually I'll probably upgrade to a 750 once I upgrade the rest of my hardware. But yeah, that about sums it up for this video guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe.